Right, welcome, welcome to Robin Minata's Matchday 40 Experience. Hello everybody, Robin Minata's Footy here, and today it is time for another Matchday Experience on Robin Minata's Footy channel here. Overnight we took on Wigan Athletic at the New York Stadium, and we managed to draw one all against Wigan. Our score was by Ollie Rathbone, and I can't remember who scored for Wigan. It was a pretty good game that and now we move on to midweek action tonight it is another trip to new york stadium which is rotherham united versus morecambe tonight at 7 45 kickoff my score prediction is going to be three nil to the millers i think uh, dan barlacell will score i think ben wiles will score and michael smith will score tonight yes it's going to be a, i hope it's going to be a pretty good game tonight to be honest and let's keep this old beat run going. There's nothing special on this match day experience tonight, like I did overnight. So anyway then guys, um, I'll see you in a bit. Enjoy the video. Come on, Mellis, tonight. Come on, we're going to win 3-0 tonight. Come on. Rusty again, you join us on Wigan video and what's today's goal prediction against Morecambe? 2-0 tonight Tom. Well, who's going to score? I'll go with Smith and on Barlatt tonight. Okay, thank you very much. Right, we have another special guest here called Thomas Main and he was on the Wigan video. He's a new guy to this videos and what's your tonight's goal prediction against Morecambe? My score prediction today is 3-0. Goal coming by Michael Smith. Michael Smith again and 2-2. Two -two. Thank you very much. Right, tell us your name. Uh, my name's Nick and my score prediction is 4-1 with goals coming from Michael Smith, Michael Smith again, Ben Wiles and Fred Thank you very much, mate. I'm us. Go, Robin!
fish, yeah. Welcome to the AES Steel at the New York Stadium. You have a lot of Rock United, but this is going to get only one fixture. It is the Millers versus Millicom. We extend a very warm welcome to the directors, management, players, and support support. You've made the trip to join us here on the island this evening. We'd also like to welcome from our sponsors this evening, and that sponsor, obviously, the Rock and Roll Chamber of Commerce, and our next door sponsor, the Cards Day UK. Also, welcome to our Yeah, uh, 
have made 106 appearances anyway, in Northern Ireland Colours, but his real idea. success came during his time in charge of the Lions, and he did his first full season back at Melbourne, which would see him land the club's most recent league title, which they won under his guidance in 1989. Trevor was a local lad, heralding from Canclo, who had gone on to become a one-man club with his own team side of Melbourne United. Moved into the first team by the legendary Tommy Doherty, Trevor impressed and never looked back, going on to turn out 328 times for the Millers. A natural central defender, strong in the tackle, Trevor's highlights in promotion from Division 4 and playing alongside the great Dave Watson. Members of both Billy and Trevor's families are in attendance tonight as guests of the club. Ladies and gentlemen, we invite you to join us in a period of applause as a part of the steps. No, I wouldn't say it. You would, yeah. You 
wouldn't even know it was clean as the bad. It went for a few drinks. Oh, 
substituted for more from Spencer by Casey and Grace Management. And off number 27, Chris Manning with Barman, who will play to number 10 and 1.
guys it's time to end this match day experience from last night well we managed to win 2-0 last night against Morecambe at the New York Stadium let me tell you what we did last night we travelled out to New York Stadium we went straight down last night going to ground about 7 and we're going to my stand and took a seat and watched teams warm up and listen to team news announcements and all that we had a minute's applause before the kickoff, and what do I say about my match report? I thought first off we was brilliant till probably 40th minute in game. Morka were trying to get tricky with us and that, but we scored two goals in first off by Freddie Alapo in first off twice, 
lucky for him last night I was pleased to see him go after a few good weeks or so so anyway um, after that uh, got 2-0 up at half time and the second half it was really tough Morecambe were training it on us they were trying to nick a few goals at the same time as well and yes um, but I am glad with three points last night um, 2 0 win. We are six clear now. We're 72 points now at top at league. And that, and then after the match, we clapped them off and then we headed straight home. Right then, uh, that is it really to say for this video. Um, next up for Roman United, it's the longest trip of the season on Saturday, which is Plymouth Argyle at Home Park. People are thinking, are you going on that very long trip to Plymouth? Yes, I am going to Plymouth on Saturday. In Devon, down at Plymouth, I mean. So yes, uh, yes, I'll be making the longest trip of the season on Saturday down to Plymouth. And, and the upload will be on Sunday, of course. And then a week on Tuesday, like a week yesterday, we are away at Shrewsbury Town at McGullery Water Meadows Stadium uh, so that's a Tuesday night fixture and of course I'll be going to Shrewsbury next Tuesday night and then next tour game for the Millers it will be on Saturday 5th of March to MK Dons right then guys uh, that is it for this video right then guys um... please, please like, like and, and subscribe, subscribe to Rotherham United, United Footy and don't forget Thank you very much for watching and I will see you all on Saturday when, when we do the longest trip of the season to Plymouth. The upload will be on Sunday after the more evening. Thank you very much for watching and I will see you next time on our United Footy Channel. Goodbye.